Hi there, this is Professor Monty, and let's do the determinant of a three by three matrix. And I'm not gonna do the traditional way of doing it, I'm gonna do a shortcut method, sometimes called the basket weave method. But we've got our three by three determinant here. We know it's a determinant because we've got the straight lines instead of the brackets. But what we're gonna do to do this method is we take the first two columns and write them again over here to the right. So we'll go one, four, two, three, one, zero. And now what I do, remember when we take the derivative of the two by two matrix, we multiply down the diagonal minus we multiply up. We're doing that same thing, but only in the diagonals that have three numbers in it. So for instance, this is just the number two. Here I've only got two numbers in the diagonal. Here's my first diagonal where I've got three numbers. So I'm multiplying all three of those together. One times one times five is five. So I'll put that over here. The next one, there's three in a row here too. Three times six is 18 times two is 36. So I go plus 36. And then here's another three of them. Two times four times zero is zero. There's no more diagonals of three going down, but there's diagonals going up of three. So I look for my first one there. There's only two there. So here's my first one. When I go up, just like with the two by two, I go minus. So this can be minus four. Here's another three by three, zero times six times one, that's just zero. So minus zero. And then the last one, Five times four is 20 times three is 60. So minus 60. That doesn't quite fit right there. We'll put it here. So let's see. So I've got, here I've got 41. And here I've got minus 64. And so now I just put those together. And the 41 minus 64 is just going to be negative 23. That's my determinant. And that's all I do. So again, practice these. Anytime you go down, you keep the sign, and then you go minus, and then multiply up any groups of three in the diagonal. So that's it. Hopefully you like that. If you did, go ahead and click on the like button. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do that. Go ahead and click on subscribe. But other than that, I'll just keep making these videos, and you'll just keep doing this, and you'll just keep learning more and more and getting a good grade in your class. So hopefully that helped. But just keep doing, you'll get it, and it's not so bad.